Hi everybody, how are you today? Uh, today I want to do a quick haul. I'm so excited about all of it. I'm really excited. Um, I guess I'll get out of the way first. Um, I got more sunnies. I'm addicted to good sunnies. Like, I mean, the majority, I'd say 90% of what I have is Ray-Bans. But today I have four new pair and they're Ray-Bans and I'm very excited about them so I want to share them with you and then I'll go on to some of the other stuff. The first pair, let's see which ones these are, they came in the, the brown case. Oh, these are the classic uh, Club Masters, which I love, all black with the green lenses, the traditional green lenses. Love them. I just love these. I love the classic ones, the um, the Club Masters, New Wayfarers, Aviators. I mean, you can't go wrong with them, especially when you get them in like the traditional colors, like the basic black. They'll go with everything. And the tortoise. I feel the same way about the tortoise. The tortoise will go with everything. And let's see. I believe these are the... I won't even guess. Oh, these are the rounds, which... I already have a couple pair of the rounds but in different lenses but I got the classic lenses in the round what do they call it the G15 lens so I got these which I love love them don't mind my hair today guys uh, and I have very minimum very minimal makeup on I just finished doing my walking we're all off schedule around here because it is spring break time so I'm off of my routine of getting up getting McKenna to school and then coming straight back and walking we were able to sleep in so I just finished my walking um, here's another pair these are the new Wayfarers they came in a black case and I love these too. I got these polarized with the classic G15 lens. And I love them. I mean, these are just the, the classic traditional. Now, the, they're the new Wayfarers. They're different from the original Wayfarers because, for one, they're smaller. And um, they're straight. They don't go in like the originals do. And I love these. Okay. One more pair that I just got today and it is an early Mother's Day present because um, the, I think it was the day before April Fool's I got an email from Ray-Ban and it said no joke 25% off today only and I've been looking at these they just came out it's a whole new different um, shape a whole new different sunglass and I'm in love with it. It's called the Club Round. And I got it in Tortoise and the G15 lens. And I'm in love. I got $40 off from Ray-Ban's website. And I love these. I just got them a couple hours ago. So I haven't worn them yet. So the sticker on them. But they're a cross between the rounds and the um, Club Masters. That's why they call them Club Round. And I really like them a lot. And with it coming with me getting them in the tortoise I mean it's classic you almost can't even tell they almost look black that's what I like about the black in the tortoise you know they're very versatile so that's all in the way of sunglasses for this haul and so now I'll show you I got um, I think it was five dollars off they sent me through email, I'm not sure why, but I got $5 off, so I ordered this with free shipping off a Too Faced website. It's the Pink Leopard Blushing Bronzer. I love Too Faced bronzers. I have the Chocolate Soleil. I have the other one too. It's called the, I think it's called the Sun Bunny. And so this one, it's just beautiful. I love anything leopard print anyway. But this is gorgeous. I wore it yesterday. I don't have it on today because I don't have a whole lot of makeup on. But I put this on as a bronzer yesterday. And it was just, it's beautiful. It just, you swirl it together. And it's just very, you're not going to be able to see it on my hand probably. It's right there. But it just looks 
fairly natural but with a little bit of sheen to it a little bit of glow you can see it on my middle finger I mean it has a little glow to it but when you use the right brush I used my Marc Jacobs the bronze brush and um, it, it did it perfectly so I really love this and the whole reason I was on Too Faced's website was for the peanut butter palette I've been so dying to get this and I should have wore it today, you all, but I barely have. I'll show you what I have on my face when I'm done. I mean, I barely have anything. But I've used this already, and it's gorgeous. And it smells so good. It's not overwhelming. I know some people are just turned off by the fact that it smells like peanut butter. But really, it's not. It's not like the cheap artificial flavor candy, peanut butter flavor candy. It's, it doesn't have that gross smell. It smells really good, just like their chocolate scented stuff smell. I mean, it's it's really done beautifully. You could tell the ones I've been using a lot. I love the, I use the peanut brittle, peanut butter, jamming, soft and sweet. I just love it. And I am going to step out of my comfort zone. I've already decided. And guy, I'm going to try this jelly color, even if it's just under my lash my lower lash line I'm gonna try it I mean look at that that's pretty and it's so not what I ever ever try so got the peanut butter and jelly palette I'm so excited I was so happy to get it now I'm on the mission to get the Too Faced Sweet Peach special edition palette that thing has been so hard to get a hold of <sighs> It just keeps selling out, but I think it's supposed to be a week from this Friday. They're supposed to have it in stores at Sephora, and I am going to be there before they open the doors and walk in. And if they're already sold out as soon as they open the doors, something's wrong. I mean, that's, that's, that's bad advertising. So, I'm getting that palette because I've heard nothing but good about it, and it's just... It looks beautiful. All of Too Faced palettes, every single one of them that I have, and I have quite a few, they are all just gorgeous. I love them. Okay, so now all I have left now is um, this new phone case, which I love. It's a mirror. This one is rose gold. Got it off of, got that one off of Amazon. This one I got off another website. I'm not sure, but it costs more. It was before I found them on Amazon. This one, I've got it. It's not in my phone this one is just straight up gold and this one is the rose gold I want to get the one in pink okay that's it guys thank you for sticking with me um, I plan on doing my next video about the um, the Sephora magic eraser I forget what they call it but it's the makeup eraser the black towel that they use I want to talk about that a little bit so that'll be my next video thank you so much guys for stopping by and I'll see you next time bye oh what I have on my face is I just have some concealer and then I have oh no I can't buy it okay for foundation um, I'm using my MAC Medium Plus Mineralized Skin Finish Powder. And then I'm using my Anastasia Beverly Hills Contour Kit. I use that for my contour, my highlight, and I use it on my eyes. For my crease, I use this. And then for my brow bone, I used that. And then for the highlight, I used that. And for contour, I used that one. And for under my eyes, I used the banana. And so that's what I used on my whole face. For my blush, I used my Benefit Coralista and eyeliner and mascara and quick lip gloss. Angelique Christian Dior. And my mascara is L'Oreal Telescopic Carbon Black. And my eyeliner is the Smoldering Eyeliner in Black. What's it from L'Oreal or Maybelline? I forget which one. But you all know it's my favorite. So thanks for stopping by, guys, and I will talk to you later. Bye.